Hi everyone and welcome to 80 Weimar Crescent in Titarangi. My name's Finn from the local office just up the road so to give you an idea about the position it's probably about a 10 minute walk back to the village so you've got the cafes, the restaurants, the bars all at your fingertips. Now Titarangi Primary and Woodlands Park you're in zone for both of those again a nice easy walk to those so 80 Weimar Crescent we've sold a number of these mid-century homes this year but this one it raises the bar to another level it's impeccably renovated throughout the styling's amazing so let's go through and I'll show you around all of the features that this wonderful property has to offer. So here we are in the main living of the home, so it's open plan, you've got that beautiful white pallet there, the whitewash floors, the connection to inside and out through both sides of the living. Now, there's a reason that this home made front cover of Homes magazine last year and it's all the bespoke features throughout the home which have been handcrafted by the owners. These stone tops for example, to my right you've got that really cool walk-in pantry with the feature door, again the staircase, it's one off. Everything here is just custom made and it really is the soul of the home. Now for me, a kitchen isn't just a place where you prepare meals, it should be a space where you can get your friends and family together, it should be interactive with the outdoors. Now this kitchen, they've absolutely nailed it. So you've got this good central island here, great space, your friends and family, they'll gather around while you're preparing meals. Again, slip out through the French doors, out to those big decks and enjoy the sun. Now not only does this home look good, but it also feels good. So a lot of effort's gone in, they've insulated the ceiling, all of the walls, under the floors. There's an HRV system, now all of the bedrooms on the upper level, they all receive the benefit of the HRV. You've got the heat pump there as well, but for those cosy winter nights, you've got the wood burner as well. Now for me, this bathroom, we could actually make a video all of its own just for here. So you walk in, you've got those stylish white mosaic tiles with the black grout featuring throughout. Again, white walls just to give that really beautiful contrast throughout. The black tapware just sets off against that white backdrop and you've got the restored clawfoot bath there with the bespoke tap. Now for the lucky new owners of 80 Weimar Crescent, you are going to love the master bedroom. So again, the white walls, the blonded floors, they've been carried through to this room. It's a big spacious room, you've got lots of glass to let the light in and the bush to look out at. The mid-century cornicing up on the ceiling there. The wardrobe, it's had a birthday as well, so you've got all of the organisers through there. But what I love most about this, open the French doors in the summertime, this is going to be such a beautiful room. Now as we said in the marketing, this home is going to impress you room by room. So here we are, we've popped down the stairs, you're in the second living space now. For families who are wanting that second space for the kids to escape to, or a rumpus room, a games room, or just somewhere to watch TV away from the rest of the home, this is going to be brilliant. Now to my left, you do have the fourth bedroom and the ensuite there to enjoy as well. Now the grounds of this property, they're absolutely beautiful. You've got that classic Titarangi bush setting, but you've got the perfect compromise between usable ground and the bush, and also the sun as well. So you do get lots of sun, and the property's just framed with beautiful mature cowries. There's lots of grass for the kids to play, and endless opportunities for entertaining. Well that brings us to an end here for our video tour of 80 Weimar Crescent. Make sure you come along to the open homes and check this incredible mid-century home out. We'll be running open homes for the next three weeks from 2 to 2.30 on Saturdays and Sundays. The auction's booked in, it's an on-site auction, it's 3pm on the 26th of November. We look forward to meeting over the next few weeks.